My dad introduced me to the game of golf at age six, and I do have vivid memories of starting out, not at Alberni Golf Club, but a little executive course that they had in Port Alberni and kind of working my way up through there and not really understanding the rules of golf until closer to like age nine or 10. And then once I was age 12, I was big enough to go to the big course. I remember being the only junior girl at Alberni Golf Club well into my teenage years. I recall in grade six, uh, telling my friends that I wanted a sand wedge for Christmas and everyone thought I wanted a sandwich. But golf requires so much concentration and determination and as most golfers know it's such a mental sport and a mental grind and I really liked the idea that it was all on you and you could make it happen if you wanted to and for me everything kind of changed in 1999 I did well the first two days at the BC Junior, not understanding that it was a qualifier for the World Junior in San Diego at Torrey Pines. And so I qualified for that, played lights out the first three days of the tournament and was top Canadian. So I didn't dream about going to Albuquerque, but that's where I ended up going and it was an amazing experience. So I got into UVic Law and it was my husband who said, you know, I think you can play in the Canadian University Championships. You should talk to the coach. If you knew golf in British Columbia, you knew who Christina Spence was. We touched base together and then I followed up, made sure she was eligible, which didn't make some schools in Canada very happy, uh, but found out that she was eligible to play for us. Such a strong golfer and, and it just, it was apparent instantly to all the girls on the team that, that uh, you know, this was a real leader for them. Uh, my dad, who introduced me to the game, was diagnosed with cancer in law school. So I have some very negative memories of law school for those reasons. He passed away during my third year at law school and nationals at UVic at Cordova Bay was the first tournament since he had passed away. So I was thinking of my dad every single shot that week. 